The concern is that underrepresented communities will be hit hardest by an undercount. The Census Bureau says that 99.9% .9 of households here in Arizona have been counted. That's compared to about 89% a month ago. But when you look closely at the numbers, you see that the Navajo Nation area has one of the lowest response rates in the country. Of course, we're disappointed. Navajo Nation President Jonathan Nez was hoping to have until the end of this month to get his people counted in the 2020 census. He says they've been pushing to get people to respond these past several weeks. But as a large tribe, about 350,000 Navajos uh, with a, a land uh, span of uh, 27,000 square miles, of course, uh, we didn't reach everyone in time, especially with the limited telecommunication and broadband access to get the information out to our people. Census numbers on Wednesday showed 99.9% .9 of households in Maricopa County had been counted, but only 96.3% had been counted in Window Rock in the Navajo Nation. It is very important for the future of the Navajo Nation. Census numbers help determine how many seats each state will have in the U.S. House of Representatives. It also guides how billions of dollars in federal, state, and tribal funding is distributed, impacting everything from schools to hospitals, roads, and other public works. That money could make a huge difference and the lives of the people living there. Emily Kelly with the U.S. Census Bureau says groups in Arizona have been targeting Latino and tribal communities, historically hard to count areas. They may not want to respond to the 2020 census for a number of reasons, whether it's someone who distrusts the government or, you know, maybe isn't in the country legally. Maybe they just really don't want to talk to anyone right now during COVID-19. Kelly says they still have people out in the Navajo Nation trying to get everyone counted. Because of COVID outbreaks in various places, we had to pause some of our operations, uh, but we've been working very, very hard out of the Window Rock Area Census Office to make sure that we're getting enumerators out to all of those uh, households that haven't responded yet. If you have not responded to the census, you have until Thursday. We've got details how to do it online or on the phone at abc15.com. I'm Claudia Rupsich, ABC 15 Arizona.